Welcome Leos, I'm back with another video. This is gonna be for the remainder of January. If you are interested in booking a personal reading with me, that information is gonna be in the drop box below. As well, if you would like to check out the website to support the channel, that information is gonna be in the drop box below as well. All right, so let's talk Leos. Let's see what messages we got for the Leo. All right, this is going to be for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, as well as North Node. What messages are there for Leo? For my newbies, hey y'all, go ahead and click the bell to subscribe. You don't want to miss out on future videos. All right, so let's do it, Leos. Ooh, we got y'all at the seven of wands. So y'all are feeling on edge or like you feel like you need to defend yourself. I'm getting like y'all feel like breaking the rules. <laughs> y'all feel like breaking the rules or you, okay, we got the four of cups and the nine of swords. I'm getting like y'all not worried. Cause y'all gonna break the rules anyway. <laughs> so bold of you. <laughs> all right let's see we got the ten of wands y'all feeling burdened six of swords the ten of pentacles the queen of wands seven of pentacles the five of cups the empress three of wands chariot and the outcome is the tower Woo! did somebody cross a boundary with you or you crossed the boundary but a boundary was definitely crossed here see the hierophant he's all about boundaries and rules and regulations the seven of one the seven of wands here is like fuck those rules excuse my language <laughs> but yeah that's what that energy is i'm gonna break all the rules i'm breaking all the rules i ain't worried about i ain't worried about that i don't care maybe you're feeling really in control possibly a little stubborn <laughs> Okay, let's see what we got here. We got the Ten of Wands. So, why is the Ten of Wands here? The Lovers. The Lovers. There's a decision. Okay. So, we got the Nine of Pentacles and the Sun. This is you guys' energy, but I'm getting growth as well. But some of y'all are either single, happy single, um, hap I'm saying happily single. Yeah, that's how I would say it. Yeah, happily single. <laughs> like you're in a relationship with your, your goddamn self and you're happy and you're growing and you're flowing and you're abundant. But then we got that lovers here. Okay, that lovers is a decision in love. I'm getting a big decision. My lovers here. The Eight of Wands. The Queen of Cups. All right. The Eight of Wands and the Queen of Cups. This is Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio's energy. The Eight of Wands is communication. So maybe you're in communication with the water sign here. Or you want to be told... You want to be told how you want to be adored. You want to be admired. You want to be admired here. Some of y'all are holding back tears. What's this? We 
you got the devil here, it's Capricorn energy. <laughs> Some of y'all haven't had none in a while. <laughs> we got the devil and the ace of wands. This is heavily sexual energy here. That two of swords is saying, maybe you haven't had that in a while. <laughs> y'all are restriction. Y'all ready to uh, some some of y'all are have been practicing celibacy or you know not engaging in those type of activities. <laughs> All right, so let's see. We got the six of swords and that hierophant. Some of y'all are definitely like breaking a commitment. <laughs> Okay, there could possibly even be a marriage here. Like somebody's legally married with the justice and the hierophant. This could be a legal marriage here. But I'm getting like breaking the rules. <laughs> Why is the ten of pentacles here? Temperance. Temperance, okay. Some of y'all are focused on your pentacle. Could be dealing with the Sagittarius. Some of y'all are focused on your pentacle. And balancing your money. I'm still getting. You're waiting for somebody to make up their mind. I'm getting like you're trying to win a battle here. Somebody's fighting for attention. The five of wands and the six of wands. is definitely somebody... There's a competition here. You're fighting to win some type of battle, some type of competition for somebody's affection. The King Cups. Somebody here could be dealing with the Pisces, um, but somebody here like hides their feelings here. All right, the Queen of Wands. Yeah, you guys, it's energy, strength. So you're trying to have the strength and the courage here to tell um, how you feel. You feel burdened by a situation. And you're waiting for somebody, for things to balance out um, and to make a decision. Seven of Pentacles in the past. I feel like you was waiting for um, for somebody to communicate with you. You were waiting for somebody to be honest here about a marriage. The Four of Wands and the Ace of Swords. I'm here and tell the truth. Oh, okay. We got the Moon and the Ten of Cups. This is someone hiding a relationship here. This is someone hiding, uh, yes, a secret relationship here. Yeah, we got somebody here playing. The Knight of Wands and the Emperor. A baby father or something like that. A baby mama or something, something like that. So maybe you've been waiting a long time to tell somebody how you feel. Somebody possibly have you in the dark or you got somebody in the dark. Why is the Five of Cups here? For future energy. Yeah, you're hoping that they have something. You're hoping that they regret something. We got Knight of Pentacles, Capricorn's energy. Yep. Yeah. The King of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. You're uninterested and you are bored with the connection anyway. Yeah, somebody's hiding that they're married or in a relationship or something. Somebody's hiding a relationship and they're married. Okay, and the truth came out. Why is the Knight of Pentacles here? Queen of Swords, yeah. You cut somebody off. You're rejecting somebody. 
You're leaving somebody in, out in the cold. Yep. Eight of Pentacles and the Eight of Cups. The number eight here is significant. Okay. Maybe you've been trying to cut this person off. But they just keep reaching out to you. We got you as the Empress. Why is the Empress here for my Leos? Okay. Ooh, the Hermit and the Three of Swords. You're thinking about somebody. We got the Empress and the Emperor here. So that's mother and father energy. Okay. But I'm feeling like somebody here is sad. You're sad. Maybe you want an apology. Somebody was... Whoever you're dealing with is the King of Wands energy in the sun. Somebody here is they fine as hell. Okay. They're handsome. They're beautiful. They are fun to be around. Like you enjoy their company. But I'm just getting like you still feel alone or sad. Okay. There's a sadness about this. Why is the Three of Swords here? The Wheel of Fortune. There's some things that need to be work on, worked on that need to change. This other person that's in this situation, they're waiting on you to take action. So I'm getting like they're kind of, yeah, they're afraid to take action towards you. And they're, they're planning they're thinking and they're like planning in their head their next move. Okay. So they're plotting. Okay. Because for some reason I'm getting that they're, they don't want a relationship. Okay. We got the four of cups and the ten of cups. That's somebody who's saying, no, nah, I don't really want a relationship. So they're thinking of their next move. Like they're already planning ahead. They're already planning ahead. Their exit strategy. So that's why you're here heartbroken with the three of swords and the hermit. You're trying to heal your broken heart. Ooh. So maybe you and your hopes and fears, you might want to, ooh, we got the chariot. <laughs> And the Four of Wands and the Seven of Swords. The Chariot, you may want to pull up to this person's house where he stay, where they he stay at with his wife and the kids and family or vice versa, where she stays at with the husband and this, this, that, and expose this person for their lies. They're telling lies. Okay, we got the Devil and the Page of Pentacles could be a Capricorn. Okay, because you feel... Like, you feel like, yeah, it's time. It's that time. Yeah. To let somebody know what's been going on. Woo! The magician and the ten of swords. You want to make them feel it. Ugh. Woo! Why the seven of swords here? The devil. Ooh, you feel like somebody played. You feel like you got played. Could be by a Capricorn. Oh, I'm, I'm hearing y'all. Y'all pissed, okay? We got the world, which is a closing of a chapter. And the two of cups, the ace of cups. I feel like you felt like this was a real connection, and this person is trying to walk away from you. I don't feel like y'all having it. Like, I'm hearing, don't bring your ass back. You cut off. But I still feel like you're going to be still watching this person. But this somebody like this seven of cups is somebody having options in a tennis store, somebody cutting that option off. But I feel like you're going to be free. Like you're. I feel like you're going to be free once this happens. Okay. I feel like y'all about to free. Y'all about to be free up. 
but you're trying to get this person hell. You're going to get this person hell on the way out. <laughs> you're going to get this person hell. Six of Pentacles, Five of Swords, and Five of Wands, you're going to get them hell on the way out because you need to feel like you won. You got me fucked up. <laughs> you done told me all these feelings. You done gave me all these feelings. And then you think you're just going to walk out. It's not going to be that easy. Why is the shower card here? See, the outcome is the tower. So something's about to occur. Why is the tower here? Six of wands. You about to shock everybody. <laughs> you about to shock everybody with the truth. Lord, the truth about to come out. <laughs> the truth about to come out. You're going to make them pay. You're going to make this person pay for what they did. Two of Swords. And it's because you you thought that this connection, you thought that this connection was authentic and real. And I feel like this person played with you. It was playing. Why are the Two of Swords here? Yeah, they think it's over. It ain't over. Two of Swords in the world, it's not over. <laughs> Page of Pentacles and the King of Pentacles. You could be talking to a Virgo, Taurus, or a Capricorn. They better keep their guard up. The Four of Pentacles. You better watch your back. Four of Pentacles and the Nine of Wands. Ooh. You want to hide your feelings and tell me all of this? Mm. Why the world here? You telling this person it ain't over? Yeah, you gonna get, you gonna feel how I feel. You gonna see how I feel. Uh huh. You about to hand them they karma. Night of Cups and the Sun. You finna hand them they karma. Mm mm. Yep. Look at this. Yep. You finna test shit up. The Two of Cups and the Five of Wands and the Seven of Cups. And I'm about to leave this reading on that. Yeah, you about to tell whoever they finna go to, you finna tell that shit up. Soon as you find out. You wanna keep me a secret? <laughs> Y'all off the chain, Leos. <laughs> Y'all are off the damn chain. Woo! They finna feel it, honey. They about to feel it, honey. <laughs> they about to feel it. All right, so if this message resonated with you guys, leave me a thumbs up. Y'all let me know what's going on in that comment section below, all right? Don't forget to check out the website. And if you're interested in booking a personal with me, all of that information is in the drop box below, okay? And I'm going to chat with y'all later. Ciao.